Law enforcement and the Marion County Board of Education putting their heads together to work toward one ultimate goal, and that's making schools safer. They're doing this by adding metal detectors, emergency equipment, and making sure the buildings themselves are well maintained. Gina Cadigan has more. Whether you're a parent, a grandparent, an administrator, a teacher, um, a custodian, you worry about the safety and security um, in your school. School safety is at the top of the list for educators across the country, something that was almost a close call here in West Virginia during a school shooter threat that proved to be a hoax back in December. The hoax shed a little more importance on the initiative the Sheriff's Department, Homeland Security, and the Board of Education were already working on, where often Officers went into every school in Marion County to see how they can make them safer. It includes just little things like making sure all the doors lock, making sure the windows lock. If a threat is made to a school like that again, police officers will now have a layout of the school so in case of emergency they can head to the right classrooms, making response times much faster. Time is absolutely of the essence. The longer it takes to get there, the longer it takes to react or to respond, the more lives that can be lost. Each school will also have a locker that contains equipment that police would need to breach in an emergency, things that the schools never had before. No matter what police department rise on scene, uh, all the tools that they would need to uh, make entry, safe entry into a building would be uh, housing those lockers. And another step towards safety, the county now has three weapon detectors that the schools can use. And around 50% of the uh, threat is going to come from someone inside of the school. So with these new weapons detectors, uh, we could eliminate a lot of that threat by screening the uh, students and visitors in the school. The detectors will start to be used in schools on a trial basis. The Sheriff's Department and Homeland Security will be meeting with the Marion County Board of Education to go over what they found in their assessment of every school that needs fixed. We hope that nothing ever happens in Marion County, but we want to be prepared if something would happen. For many of our students, this is the safest place um, that they spend a number of hours during their day. And um, that's very important to us. We want schools to be nurturing um, places. In Fairmont, Gina Cadigan, 12 News.